Hello, welcome to day six. I'm pretty sure it is. To my recumbent tadpole trike build. Uh, now I have a rolling chassis. And I was working on these chain loiterers today. I also needed another, a second lock nut for the boom, so I've done that. But I've been working on these today. And everything is grand now. Everything works and I made these. So if the cog in the center wears down, ever wears down, I, I can actually take out this bolt and replace the cog. So everything is, the whole, all the oilers on it are replaceable. So you can take off uh, replacing parts, you know. So didn't have that in my last one, so that's what I'm doing with this one. To make everything easier, so everything that's on it is all bolted, so it can be all taken apart. And as well as that, I did say, mention the last time, yeah, I made a foldable as well. So if I don't, uh, don't fancy being on the roof of the car, I can put it in the boot of the car. So that's it. Um, the rolling chassis I have done now. So what's left to be done is, is a. Uh, make up the bracket for the, the seat and I'm going to make it that the seat can't come off and it can tilt backwards or forwards um, so that's another thing I have to do and then when that's done I have that done that part um, I, I can I can only put on the handlebars on I can only put on the handlebars when the seat is on so you know for measuring but when that's done and that's done uh, strip everything off, uh, paint the whole frame, spray it up, then when that's done and all lacquered and all, then you know the usual, um, kit it out then with all the uh, cables that's needed for it, and then it'll be the, I think the next video is going to be me testing it, so uh, if you're interested in this build, uh, keep looking, you know, and tell us what you Tell us what you think in the comments box below. Um, what, what, if you've been following my channel, you know. Okay, that's all I'm going to ramble on about. So thanks for watching. Catch you on the on the next one. Bye.